play, how close did you come to throwing that ball to Justin? And from where did you jump into the end zone? Was it on the three yard line? Um, I came, I think it was just like a split second decision. I was really about to throw the ball, but I saw like five defenders go towards him, and uh, nobody was really in the middle. So, I mean, yeah, I think I threw it from like a three, but I knew I had to throw everyone. So. <laughs> how much did you clear the line? Probably from my wrist. So there, I barely got in. Well, how does it feel to know that the video you scored on a touchdown probably played for many, many years and your name will kind of be associated with that? Well, it's a, it's a great feeling, especially to do it for a great institution. And uh, I, I mean, we've got great guys, and uh, just to have that, that video playing back, it, it, it says a lot about us. A lot of the great plays in this series have a nickname. What, <laughs> what should yours be called? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll let I'll let some I am not not really sure. Uh, when I find out, I'll let you know. <laughs> Your freedom to run or pass was was only because it was third down. Otherwise, well, would it be different? Well, Coach Johnson told me to be smart, and he, felt, he said if I felt like I couldn't get it to him, just be smart and run the ball. So that's what I did. Do you feel like you're Showing pass through guys to Justin? Or? Uh, uh, definitely, I, I think it, does, it did. Um, you know, just give him a little pump fade or looking that way. You know, I, I think that that made him go that way. Was that put in just for this game, or is that something y'all had in for uh, a while? That's what we had since I got here. Okay. Yeah, we just that's great. <laughs> how, long, how long since you been a deep boy? I know it's been a long time. It still was. <laughs> How difficult was it for you guys to watch those final 30 seconds after you got the lead? It was tough, you know, you because all they needed was a field goal. So if they had one big catch from across the middle, it's really anything. So I think the defense did great in that aspect. They even had a big turnover to give us the ball in the short field to make us you know, win the drive. Just if we could go back to the, the one play that was probably not going to the one where you were stopped on fourth down. You know, right there, it's a, it's a 13 point game. They're at midfield. They're about to do one more score, and then you're in serious trouble. When you were coming off, did you think, yeah, we're still going to win this? Well, I definitely had faith in my guys. Uh, not one moment that I thought it was going to the game. Uh, I knew some, some, not just one person, but all of us would have to make a play. And uh, that's what we did coming in, especially uh, 13 points down. And I feel like we made a lot of plays to uh, win the game. Justin, can you talk about kind of what your message was to the team and staying calm after a really horrendous third quarter offensively for you guys? Yeah, I, mean, I was just told you know, it's still a two-position game. You know, we had a lot of time. There was still like seven minutes left in the third quarter. So it wasn't the game wasn't out of reach. All we did was one big play, one stop, and you know, get a good drive going. We finally got it. We made it. One of the hardest jobs that was 90 yards, but we got it, and that kind of gave us the momentum. Yeah. Do you think that all those, I mean, you've had tons of one minute scoring drives and all that stuff, do you think having that much success all year it really kind of helped keep the confidence level up even as the time started to drip away? I think so. I think you know, everybody was still poised. Nobody had their heads down, like, you know, the game was over. So we knew if we could just get one in, the defense was doing its job you know, for the most part, you know, and, uh, we got a, got a score. Everyone stopped and give us the ball back. Give us one more time for the possession, which they did. So. Justin, your thoughts on um, you know being one? I think the first Tech quarterback to beat Georgia twice, and I think it's Joe Hamilton, and first to win twice. It happened since who knows when? Does that Normandy of that really kind of struck you yet? Or oh, what that means? I, really, I mean, I just feel great just to win the game. Period. You know, especially in that form that we did. But it's just going. I guess you give it that stat because being able to go down as one of those quarterbacks, you know, it's a great feeling, um, especially going out as a senior. Um, in play scores and you take the point and you got one, you see 37. So you flashed back to the eight years ago. Yeah, I mean, I, I, like I said before, you know, that anything can happen in 30 seconds is a long time. You know, they just need one big play to get to it, you know, the field goals, the kicker, the field goal there. So, I was, it was nothing we could do at that point. You know, we could just hope for the best and, you know, get behind the defense. 
it seemed like Coach Johnson kind of challenged you to, to get downhill more this week, and you did that early on. You guys had a lot of success with that. Is that something you were kind of thinking about as the, the game got going? Um, yeah, because I kind of seen how they were playing, and I seen the, the battle was going real fast. So I just if I get five or six, you know, maybe break one with it from the back side. But just doing that, it kind of creates a better alley for the a back once I get a picture. And it was having some success. A lot of it was really good. The 94-yard touchdown drive, was there one slide in particular that you had a pass, I think, to Fred and another one that yeah. kind of got you going. Kind of. Yeah, that was that that one to Brad. You know, just got us backed out our own end zone you know, to begin with, and we seen that what the defense was doing. Quay was actually open the first time we ran it, so he said run it again, and he was open the second time too. So those two big plays you know, were huge. Got us on our own side of the field, and we were able to make some make some happen. Anything else for Justin or Quay? Did you either of you see the interception and what was your reaction? Yeah, I mean, I was watching the whole time, and when he did, you know, I, I felt we already had the momentum going in, and when he he did that, I was like, we got to score, you know, we didn't have a choice, and we were trying to rush and do anything like that, and we, we started to pull the ball those last few minutes, and it worked out perfectly. Well, you, you scored the ball touchdown, you had a long pass play. Did you feel those marshals come around the edge? You took a heck of a block. How did you feel the change? I don't recall you doing a blocker in time. <laughs> well, it, it's just the will to win, and um, you know, I, I, I tell him, I told him when he um, ran out of bounds, I was like, man, just follow me, I got you. I, I'm not gonna let you get hit. But I mean, yeah, like I say, just the will to win. Okay.